So, in this video tutorial, we will see how to access .NET. For this, we have to install the browser. So, open your browser and go to torproject.org website. So, what is Tor? Tor is free software and an open network that help you to defend against traffic analysis. It's a form of network surveillance that train personal freedom and privacy. You can do here your confidential business activities and relationships. You can see a lot of military and law enforcement also using Tor for communication and investigation. So for download, you have to click on download and select your operating system. Like right now I am using Windows. So I have to click on download Tor for Windows. Even if you want to support the Tor, you can donate. So if you are using Mac or Linux operating system, you can click those links and download for your system. I am using Windows, so I have to click here. Then click on save to save it. There are the documentation about how exactly the tour works. You can read if you want to. Let's wait till the Tor browser is downloaded. Even you can go to blog and see their latest post about the Tor browser. If there is any update, and any new functionality in Tor browser added, you can see here. If you are interested in knowing more about the tour, you can read documentation. A stored browser is successfully downloaded. Open it, I am just copying it to my desktop. Oops. So I successfully moved the tour to my desktop. You can see it here. Double click to install it and click on run. Select your preferable language and click on OK. Select your destination folder where you want to install the Tor browser and click on install. And if you want to run the Tor browser, you can click to run and click on finish. You can see here, the new folder is generated here. Don't try to delete this folder, otherwise the tour will not work. Now oh, I am going to connect my browser to Tor network. Want to connect or configure bridge or local proxy setting, you can click on configure. But I want to directly connect to the Tor network. So click on connect. And it will take little bit time depending on your internet connection to establish a Tor circuit. You can see our Tor browser is open up. Now we can serve that on your extension website. In the next lecture, we are talking about Tor search engines. 
see you in the next lecture